Tabernos. We are particularly looking forward to this region. A lot of western movies were shot here, one of my new favorite places. Southern Spain has so much to offer, like Valencia, the perfect combination of tradition and modernity. Discovering all these regions is a lot of fun, especially when you're driving a Tesla, like we are. In this episode, we drive to the Tabernas Desert, where many well-known films were filmed, including many Western movies. But before we head into the Spanish desert, we make a stop in Córdoba, a city spread in history, with many Moorish influences. We will drive to Valencia, a city with fascinating modern architecture and the home of the well-known and incredibly delicious paella. Our route takes us via Córdoba to the Tabernas Desert, from there to Valencia and then towards Switzerland. When we arrive in Córdoba, it's already evening. Time for dinner. In the Mercado Victoria, there is a large selection of different Spanish tapas and dishes. And once again, we choose tortilla. We are here in the food court and we try different kinds of tortilla and they are so good, you have to try them. The food is incredibly good here and also the mood. It's fun, good vibes, loud, colorful, just rousing. In Spain you can find good food everywhere and the next morning we want to have typically Spanish, freshly made churros for breakfast. So she made our churros, churros. De Murcia. Very good, you have to try them. Cordoba's history goes back a long way. The Romans, the Moor and many more found favor in the city. When you walk to the city, you can see the different architectural influences, a beautiful combination. The Mesquita Cathedral is probably the most beautiful building in Córdoba. Originally it was built as a mosque and later converted into a church. To the beautiful colorful allies you can let yourself drift wonderfully. Yes, I have to say, Córdoba is really worth a visit. But now we want to go to the famous Spanish Tabernas Desert. On the long route we charge twice at the Spanish Endesa X charging stations. We are happy that Endesa X is so well represented here in the south of Spain. We've been looking forward to the Tabernas Desert for a long time. So beautiful here, no wonder this area is still used as a film set for countless films. A large number of western movies were shot here and the western town film set can also be visited. One of my favorite movies is made here, Lawrence from Arabia. Have you seen a cowboy? <laughs> Where? <laughs> And let's go! Beautiful as it is, we have to be careful. There are also scorpions in this area. We saw one too. The thing about traveling is, you can hear a lot of an area, but you really know how it is when you are there. You have to feel it, you have to see it, you have to, to smell it. So. This area, especially desert areas, we really love and we are very happy to be here. We drive a little further, the area is huge. We didn't even know what that was under the bridge until a man told us they were setting up a film set for a new thriller. And so we just walk through the film set here. Beautiful, no wonder this is the perfect location for many films. We could be anywhere, in Mexico, the Wild West, North Africa or the Middle East. This road trip is wonderful. The trip here is a lot of fun, something completely different again. Fulfilled with all that we have experienced, we make our way to Valencia. Rice is grown in the area south of the city. We have heard that the fishing village of El Pamar is said to have super delicious original Paella Valenciana. And our way there leads us to the rice fields. There's a totally relaxed atmosphere in the village. El Pamar is a popular place to visit from Valencia. And there are a lot of restaurants here, with the rice fields all around and the fresh fish, a perfect place for it. And of course, we are hungry. Today we are really looking forward to a Valencian paella, but first we start with different starters. Aioli and tomatoes. 
The portions of the appetizers are large and they are incredibly tasty. Traditional paella. What a big portion here. Paella is the national dish of the region of Valencia and it consists of rice, chicken, rabbit, green beans, butter beans and saffron. An absolutely delicious combination. And dishes that you eat together from a pan are wonderfully connecting. But now we want to see Valencia. We've heard a lot about the city. We actually wanted to charge our Tesla in the parking garage. But only one of the destination charger works and charging at the other chargers is not allowed for Teslas. We haven't experienced anything like that before. The architecture of the modern district here is incredibly fascinating. The organic shapes of the buildings remind us a little of sea creatures. Here are museums, the opera, cinemas and a huge oceanographic aquarium. If you are in Valencia, the area is a must-see. And now we are on our way back to Switzerland. Valencia! We want to get home fast and in France we decide to skip two superchargers. That was not a good idea. I really hate situations like this. Look at this. It's my fault, but um, I think we can handle it, but this is really stressful. This is really stressful. And we finally made it. I'm so happy. Monte Limar! We look forward to home. We have experienced a lot, but one thing is clear. Our journey is far from over and the next adventure is already planned. So make sure to subscribe to our channel so you don't miss any of our episodes.